Yes, aloha and good morning here from Waikiki Beach. We are right here uh, past uh, almost to Kaimana, uh, right at the Kapilani Park area, where a big beach cleanup is happening today at 10 a.m. in honor of the 120th anniversary of the Waikiki Aquarium. We already saw the celebration, and now we're learning more about the education, conservation, and action to help keep our beaches healthy. Now here we have Chessa Kaparos, who is the volunteer coordinator over at the Waikiki Aquarium. Good morning, Chessa. Tell me how important these beach cleanups are to the health of our beaches. They're really important. I think, one, to help us pick up all of this debris that's in our beaches and parks so that it doesn't make its way into the ocean, but two, to also educate the public. So the public, including our locals, um, as well as our visitors who maybe not would not know more about um, the effects that debris can have on our coastlines and our environment. Um, so they're very important. Yes, and I, I also, it can get contagious. Once you do your first beach cleanup, you never look at the beach again. You're always looking for trash. And now, it, ever since I was a kid, I made it a habit whenever I was going to the beach, pick up whatever trash I can, whenever I get out from surfing, even if I see something in the water, put it in my pocket, take it out, and bring it to the trash can just to help things be pristine. And we already got a lot of debris already. So tell me how people can participate in today's big beach cleanup. So you can go on our website, WaikikiAquarium.org, to register online. Um, today we are taking walk-ins, though, so if you are available, you can head over to the Waikiki Aquarium and join us. Yes, that sounds good. Also, Chessa, what also concerns me, and I know that's uh, for pollution as well, there's not as much beach that I remember as a kid, and that almost helps with the trash getting into the ocean a little bit better, which is not a good thing. No, absolutely. Um, as we can see, a lot of the um, tides are washing up closer and closer to our um, our walkways, our pedestrian walkways, and um, taking away a lot of the sand and beach. So if there's a lot of trash that's make its way onto the sandy part, so maybe people were out laying out um, and they left their, their trash on the beach, it can easily just get washed away straight as these tides uh, come up. Okay, so yes, it's uh, crucial that we do this, but also just for self-awareness, there's a lot of debris that we already picked up, which is just man-made stuff, packages, uh, different bottles as well, all stuff that should just be thrown in the multiple. We counted almost 30 trash cans in this area, so there shouldn't be an excuse for littering in these public beaches. So today is the time, 10 a.m. at the Waikiki Aquarium. Come over, we'll have a link so where you can register to help out. They'll give you some tools, gloves, tongs, great bucket to help out. So let's get all hands on deck, do some spring cleaning for our beach right here in Waikiki as well as all the parks around. So you're invited, everybody. And we'll have more information on kh12.com.